<laughs> I still did think about some changes, but I didn't think of so many changes happening at once. Yeah, there's a lot of things that happened uh, while we were gone, while I was trying to search for this little guy here. <laughs> After, no, actually after I, actually after I uh, found it, that's just really great. Um, yeah, <laughs> a lot of things really just happened off screen, I'm just saying. Uh, um, a direct came out, so we should just seem to just seem to go straight to, to the thing before we're going to do anything that happened before, and then we're going to do what happens now. Um, I, of course, I went to search for my magic cup, and as you saw, I had hit and a few months um literally at the beginning of freaking uh, nowhere in the in the, the knife it took me quite a while since i needed to finish uh, luigi man dark moon a lot of things happens like a lot of things just happened and nintendo direct came out featuring um that this game is about receiving a few updates Like, a lot of big updates, and I just managed to, uh, one of the things we're gonna talk about right now, but of course there was also a game coming soon in, in, in March, I believe, um, yeah, it's March, which is um, something I'm gonna get to, but the main thing that we're gonna be talking about is what happened in this game. Um, I need to go to Retro's, uh, Retro's first. There's something there that I need to catch because in Retro there's something new appearing there, and I need to get that get that done first because that is one of the new things that just happened over time. So Retro is the first priority right here. That's a shop. Oh wait, that's a shop. Okay. Uh, some Pokeballs. I need some Pokeballs. Uh, you can get your back to the if you like, but no circus on the menu. Uh, I would like the Red Hedge Station, which is the area where we need to go now. The Owl of the Isle of Armor has arrived. The train of Armor has arrived. Though it's been an hour past, please board the train, please. <laughs> Alright, first thing first, I'm going to turn other safe off. Oh, I forgot to mention that. Yeah, there's another safe. <laughs> Do you have another armor pass? Actually, I've made all the proper preparation which you can which you can observe with unclouded eyes. Please allow me to check your pass. Hmm. <laughs> to meet a slow poke, such a thing is simply elegant. Uh, looks like another one has got on the tra uh, train ridden over from the Isle of Armor. There's a lot of slowpoke living on the Isle of Armor. I'm not sure if they like traveling now, but the field training is coming in. How about we save right now? <sighs> You're a Pokemon train, right? If Slowpoke blocks the ticket gate, it'll cause trouble for other customers. Slowpoke are actually pretty heavy, so do you think you catch it for me? <sighs> Battle Slowpoke in order to catch it? <laughs> this is one of the new things that happened in this game. In this game. A Galarian Slowpoke was added to this game, which actually is a bit unique. This uh, Galarian Slowpoke, it was not originally in this game. This is a new event that happened during the update, which is a teaser thing for something coming this spring. The Isle of Armor is an area that is currently off limits for us right now. In order to get it, you need to buy DLC for that. You need to buy the expansion pass in order to get it done. 
The Galarian Slowpoke is um, just as strong as any regular Slowpoke. Just pretty nicely. But right now, it cannot evolve. The thing is that Slowpokes are... Uh, yeah, Slowpokes are really... Uh, Ball, we're ball, beast ball, the ball, the ball, the ball, the ball, the ball, the ball, just Pokeballs. The thing about these these guys are kind of that they're um, that they are supposed to be evolved into a Galarian, a Slowbro, depending on the slow or Galarian Slow King, but only uh, via special items that are found in the Isle of, uh, the Isle of Armor or. Uh, The Isle of Armor or in the uh, Crown Tundra, which is a new, which is a uh, new thing as well. But of course, now we won't have to catch it with his base 100, with 190 uh, capture rates. This thing is shiny locked, but there, you, in order to get its shiny form, you just simply have to wait for it. It's actually a rather different uh, form of uh, than its. Uh, Antonian. <laughs> and this is also part of the Isle of Armor uh, decks, but right now, uh, so, this is a Pokemon that's part of the Isle of Armor decks, so, just to so show you that this Pokemon actually uh, will not have its Pokedex entry just mentioned to us. Now, if we can just simply catch it, it will be also very nice. Thank you! The Galarian Slowpoke is out of as as less. less. Slime needs some levels. <laughs> Would you like to receive Slowpoke a nickname? Nope. <laughs> like you saw, this thing does not have a nickname. Thanks, thanks much. Slowpoke can be a big trouble to move sometimes. Hmm, how interesting. I must say, your catching style was quite simply elegant. Your apologies for the way. We have checked your armor pass. All aboard the uh, 20 L of armor, mind your step while boarding. Please be aware that we'll, there will be a connection along the way. Understood. I am headed to an island called the Isle of Armor. I've heard it's a place where one can catch rare Pokemon and do lots of training. Perhaps we shall meet again sometime. Perhaps, please excuse me. Oh, we will, but not right now. We have to wait until uh, spring for that. Because this Galarian Slowpoke will never evolve, it's also female, yay. <laughs> well, let's move it. And so that it will not cause any trouble. Go to back to Valdaria Station, now we can go and continue on with the story. Uh, I forgot that it has trouble with the... Uh, with the... Uh, with the... Uh, Wooloos right now. Also, if you actually want to know how many Magikarp it took me to catch that that one little that one little Magikarp, uh, let's just say um, about thirty, <laughs> about thirty uh, Magikarps took me to catch that thing. Uh, and there's not also I forgot about that. No, not VS. Oh, not VS. Oh, please not VS. <laughs> Get a little new wild area. New wild area. I got some little bit fresh in there. Thank you. So when I find myself like a Japanese version of the Pokemon that actually can breed with that thing, like a male one, that would be really nice. 
And I can actually hunt for its shiny version with uh, the, the Super Battle, which I can tell you I've never done actually before. I actually want that Slowpoke to be the very first one. This is the Motorstock. Motorstock City, I believe, as well. Hey, over here! The latest of you the biggest food to the wild area. Seems like you're tr trying to grab with your Pokemon Rider. You, so you should pop into the Pokemon Center. Besides, there's something in there I bet you get a kick out of if you're a real champ Pokemon champion than there is. Looks like the Rotomi is free! Rotomi are a kind of Rotom information servants. It's a handy machine for trainers. You can even use one to customize your league cards. Why don't you try playing with your league card a bit, Dar? It's simple for you. Leon's league cards. Show your achievement by making a league card. You can customize your card using Card Maker found at every Pokemon Trainer, Pokemon Center. Doing so will also update your card with all the, your latest information. Um, trainer, uh, trainers all have their own league cards, and you can swap cards with other trainers that you connect using communication mission. You can feel the league cards you collected by checking out your album, which you can find in the league card option in the X menu. Well, so sure is big, don't worry. Sonya is here to show you around a bit. Come find me after you heal your up your Pokemon. Which is necessary. An opening ceremony, yeah. I get a bit woke up when I think how excited the movement was to actually stand on the same pitch for the first time. So I have to deal with Snipe for the time being, and Terravolt especially not, but the uh, uh, Magic Carp. Uh, Wait a nickname, let's put this Wait a nickname verse. Uh, no, not you. <laughs> magic Carp. Yeah, I was trying to find myself a good nickname, but it's a female. Hmm. Actually, yeah, 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 I know what should be filling. I should think it should be filling because of uh, it's the special. It's the first uh, like, uh, yeah. I will make two of these actually. All these mention if you remember what the reference is. No thanks. Well, it should fit the Tanuki more, but uh, it's red in as Gyarados. So be on young trainers who's brave the wild area. So, do you remember your goal in Motorstock is? I'm here for the gym challenge! Yep, the gym challenge opening ceremony. By the way, the ceremony tomorrow is being held at Motorstock Stadium, okay? Use a lift over there to get to the stadium. Now, ladies, I'm going to swing by the shops while I'm here, but don't forget to register at the, at the stadiums. Now, I also need to do some shopping for the clothes, maybe I'll find something good for this uh, character. I'm rather picky when it comes to clothes, though. <laughs> 
And for the amount of uh, big nuggets I got. Yes, see. Space Marine, Star, Blue Star, Blue seems right now good. Sea Urchin, Luxury. Space Watcher, Iconic Star. Oh, sounds good. Hmm. It's gonna be difficult for me when it comes with me. With me, it's kind of difficult to actually choose my style. Okay, but I think the spots, the sports stretcher will be for now. What I'm gonna do. Uh, also, one thing: if you are changing your, um, uh, when you're changing your, uh, when you're changing your, uh, I, re I really cannot talk today. When you're changing your things. Uh, just so you know that you're when you're uh, changing your clothes at uh, one point. Uh, that's true. When you're changing your clothes, just to let you know. Uh, let me see. Just one second. I'll take that. I don't actually want for sure. I'll take that. Yes, and that's the plate glass which I don't want. Yes, I'm done showing for sure. Uh, I actually know what uh, what my other one, uh, other ones are. They actually located in mode in the uh, headshots, but I think I'm gonna go for this right now. Let's see the potion. Roar! I sure never make the same without you to show me the way, partner. Even with a large, uh, with a huge old thing like this in the ba in the bang, in the middle of the city, I still get lost. There go, right? Uh, look, tells me that you've become a trainer worthy of the endorsement I gave you. And yes, I reckon you might be even be ready to use this here. Try this uh, giving to your partner to behold. behold. The Mystic Water, he actually t uh, gives you a different item depending on what star you put. You can take that lift to the cities of Lever if you're headed to the same next. He's able to give us directions, but he's not able to take directions really nicely. It's in the all other items. Like yeah, there, quite mystic over. Yeah, you can see how much candy I got from that. Even 10 rare candies. I'm rich and I'm also ready for the... For this game. I also recommend talking to the bald guy. Ah, god damn it. May to Motor Stoke City, and this is where the opening ceremony will be held. Everyone will be watching the opening ceremony for the Sim Challenge. My mom, your mom, the whole world. Getting me a bit nervous, really. Nah, this is nerves. It's I'm only something because I'm so excited. Come on, dog. It's time to we'll learn their names. Let me talk to the ball guy. Took find the Pokeball, so you reserved a little reward. Hey, back in the Pokeball. In case you want, I'm not just any old Pokeball, but then who, who am I, you ask? Well, the answer is simple. They call me the ball guy! And they will always give you a random Pokeball every time you go. Would you like to take a look at this? This the place is packed with gym challengers. Every one of these folks is another rival. Let's get signed up. Seriously, what a piece of work. If you're here to register for the gym challenge, I'll need to see your endorsement, please. Fancy! This is the first time we've had a challenge endorsed by the champion. Well, now you've had two, because I am as well. What? 
Two of you at once? I wonder what's come over Leon this year. This year. Two of you must be something special. I'm up. I'm Leon Zillabot, in fact. I am the next champion. Can we all sign up, would you? Well, yes, I am trying to. If you'll just give me a moment. There. You two have been successfully registered as SGM Challengers. You can now choose your preferred number for uniform, if you'll be so kind. It was played on the back of the uniform if for you, 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 you must wear for any official match. Now I actually know what I'm going to do in this. I hope you can get what this number name means. 644. Number 644? Yeah, it is it? Very well. And here, please wear this challenge band at all times to identify yourself as a gym challenge. Just to let you know, that if you're not actually a big fan of the challenge band on your wrists all the time, you don't need to worry about that, because once we're done with the game, it will be gone forever. The opening ceremony for the gym challenge to be held here tomorrow. All the trainers taking part have been booked a room at a nearby Buddy drop-in. That's the league chairman for you, even booked us all hotel rooms. I'm off to check out the fancy dicks. You can see that there's two rather peculiar looking characters and even that one that just push hop out of the way. You must be challenging dark. The body you drop in is down this way, if you'll be so kind as to follow me. Challenge dog, we have arrived at the body you drop in. Try to get some rest and build your strength for what's to come. No, oh, for something that I'm not exactly a fan of. Oh yeah, looks like you got you both uh, got yourself registered. Oh hey Sonya, what you're doing at our hotel? I'm reaching the mysterious Pokemon that are said to be in the slumbering wheels. I reckon if I look into some of Kala's legends, I might some figure something out. Care to join me? You are a hero of the uh, anyway. What's this then? It's a statue of the hero who once saved the Gal region. I could run through the legend quite quick if you fancy. Came out of the first. Long ago, a great black storm covered the Gala region. People call it the darkest day. The land was assaulted by gigantic Pokemon, but they were defeated by a single young hero, bearing a sword and shield. This statue here is meant to depict the young hero of that legend. We still don't understand what kind of sword and shield the hero actually had. What's this black storm is supposed to be just another, another mystery. Whatever it was, it blotted out the skies all across Galio. I suppose that tracks with it being called the darkest day, but still. Huh, I suppose that hero must have been about as strong as Lee then. Looks like you're going to have your full, full with plenty of reaches though, Sonya. Black storms and swords and shields and all that. Will you have the eyes on you? Of course it will. I'll mother through somehow, don't you worry. You two are staying here at the hotel tonight though, aren't you? Shouldn't you get checked check in? Probably so. And we'll look out for you too, Sonya. If we hear anything about any hero or not, we'll tell you. Well, look like there's uh, quite a ruckus. What's the problem with those, those guys? I can't get checked in. What's the deal with this team yell? I can't uh, check in. That's all three of them say, apparently. We came all the way to this big city so we could probably cheer on Gym Challenge. Team Yell is here to help, actually. You're hearing a bell if you want to stop us. I'm up for that. Didn't we tell you, mate? You get in our way, and you're in for a battle. Team Yell is all about helping. Helping one very special trainer win the gym challenge, that is. 
We want to make sure she gets cheated on nice and prop. And now you're going to help us make some noise. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not exactly a big fan of Team Yell. They're supposed to be a... yeah. Yeah, they're supposed to be just a bunch of cheerleaders, actually. They're, they pretty much take the turn of cheerleaders and then... Uh, But there's a, but they're kind of getting mostly in the way. They mainly do harassment and so on, but there's many for, for, uh, a, for a specific training. I'm looking for a fight and I lost. I'm so pathetic. Alright, give me a break here. Team Yell, get revenge for me, would ya? Course I've got you covered, mate. What could be better than a battle in a lovely hotel lobby? I can you see that they actually... Um, that, that, I think it was a banner, I think it was called banner. Is from uh, one of those trainers we actually saw in uh, back in in the stadium. The concept of them is pretty cute, but they're accusing kind of, but just, uh, it's not exactly uh, my style of uh, thing. It's just a bunch of nuisances. Now, if I can actually can, uh, not getting paralyzed uh, for uh, like for more than 10 years. What's up? Water pulse. Ah, I like that. I'll keep uh, maybe for PP sake. I will keep it up, but I will have water pulse with me on the thing. I must have carried a bit. Of you, I must have got a bit carried away being in this swanky hotel now. Sorry for getting in your way. Oh man, the shrinky sophisticated air in here had me off my game. I couldn't keep my cool. I wasn't expecting checking in would be such a big fuss, dog. What's going on, sneaking some Pokemon battles without me? Don't think you can get ahead of me that easily. I need some trading in, so I'm joining. Yeah, I'll even heal up your Pokemon too. I'm up. One of this year's team challenges, and the one who's going to be the next champion. Now let's have a nice two on two. I can already hear my voice victory coming. The only sound you'll make is a whimper of defeat. The menu is dark type Pokemon, I noticed actually. You may want to remember that actually, that they mainly use dark type Pokemon. Because there's actually a reason for that. <laughs> I believe maybe it's Zigzagoon, Linoon, and Nickits, I believe it's called. Oh, there are many you know. It's many dark it's many dark type Pokemon and many those two.
My voice is unsure when I'm sad. I wanna yell, but I'm sure. I came to see the Chim Challenge opening ceremony, but this is awful. This is awful, you are so serious about doing this. Guess it was a fear that I heard coming. I think I'm about to cry. What are you lot doing here? Marnie! I think we were just... I know you're all terribly cu curious about the other gym shops, but you've got to show a bit of restraint. Sorry about them. They're just a bunch of my fans. Call themselves Team Y'all and follow me around cheering for me. I think they've let it all go to their heads a bit. Come on, you lot. Back home with you now. They're just so caught up wanting to support me and all that, that they tend to get a bit shorty with other gym challengers. Sorry if they cause you any trouble. So are you a gym challenge too? Team Yell was it? Pretty impressed that you already have a set of fan call you to call your own. <laughs> Good evening, welcome to Badoo Drop In. You must be one of the gym Pokemon trainers entering the gym challenge. Yes. Ah yes, well, young Master Dora, I see the leak has brought you in, booked uh, a room for you. And if I might, thank you for helping out of a sticky situation with those hooligans earlier. I hope you have a pleasant stay here with us. Sleep well. And I hope I'm not gonna butcher the name of gym leaders because I know what the similar ceremony is all about, and I'm not gonna be really happy about that. But I may actually <laughs> I'm gonna be butchering their name because they really have interesting names to say the least. <laughs> so this is it now my legend really begins. Watch out dark, I'll beat you to Motorstoke Stadium. Uh, that's not a race. <laughs> so the gym challenge is finally starting. I wish you luck, but I'm afraid I'm gonna be the one who the one to win. <laughs> Marty is one of my favorite characters, actually. It's actually one of my favorite characters. Of the, ca of the rivals, it's actually uh, one of my favorites. Alright, follow the person. Be careful not to lose sight of me. Are you ready to the same entrance? Please hurry to the opening ceremony. You can see that all of them are already beside us. Challenger, challenger, challenger dog, was it? We asked that, that gym uh, challengers wear their uh, uniforms for all official events. The opening ceremony marks the beginning of the gym challenge, so you know what that means? That's right, I need to get to get, I need you to get changed as well. Wonderful! You look sharp as a pin, and at 640, 644, that, that number is that really is a number for you. Now we're ready to at last to, for the opening ceremony for this year's gym challenge. Ladies and gentlemen, I am Rose, chairman of the Pokemon League. I know that everyone gathered here and everyone watching from home have all been waiting for this big moment. Yeah! It is my pleasure to announce that finally the Gala Region Gym Challenge will now begin. Yes, the Gym Challenge! Participate, m participants must defeat the 8 Gym Leaders. And get the gym, the eight gym badges to prove their skills as a trainer. Only the most worthy will have the honor of challenging the greatest champion in history. Now, I would like to invite the gym leaders to show themselves. Let's see our opponents. There's only seven of them. 
the fighting farmer. Here's the grass type expert, Milo. The raging wave, it's a mass of water types, Nessa. You have a burning man of fire. Here comes the fire type veteran, Kabu. The sign boy of mystery, Alistair, friends, two ghost type. Alistair. The master of fantastic theater, it's the charming fire type, fighting fairy type user of Opal. The high school professional, please welcome the ice type master, Melanie. And last but not least, the tamer of dragons, it's Raihan, the top gym leader. <laughs> Unfortunately, we're missing one, but. These are the gym leaders that we, we in the gallery are proud to call our own. Standing there on the pitch, in the stadium, in front of everyone, has really no words for it, but, my, but I can barely contain myself. My heart's waiting. The mail lasts up, and you're too dark. So you're the two trainers that our champion endorse himself. Welcome, and it's a delight to meet you. I'm Rose, of course. And what's this? I see you all both already possess Dynamax bats. How oh, wonderful. It seems you two have been led here by the guy who the Wishing Stars. By the way, it was my wonderful company that invented those Dynamax bands, you know. I dare say this gym challenge is looking to be an absolute blast. Very good, very good. Right. That means the whole gallery region is in for some excitement. The gym challenge is an excellent opportunity to show off your Dynamax Pokemon. Now, I'm terribly sorry, but there is some urgent business I need to attend to, so I must be on my way. The best of, of luck to you both here. The chairman certainly seems to be in high spirits. Listen closely too, you both only just saw your passive trainer. If you want to win, you need to do more than just train your Pokemon. You need to train yourself too. As you're dark, you know the gym challenge has a set order that you've got to visit the gyms in, right? The first is in turf field. To get there, we need, we need to head to Route 3. But I think that should be, yeah, yeah, we know about that. <laughs> the gym challenge is a pretty much basic thing if you're a classic Pokemon fan. <laughs> I think that should be enough. I will see you guys next time.